weapon. I'm not a thief. I don't know why I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get a lockpick. You don't get anything. Misguided, but I understand. Zira always treasured loyalty over, well, treasure. To show there's no hard feelings between us, you could try the warden's office for her transfer papers. It's under guard, but you look like you can manage. Hello and welcome back to Elder Scrolls Online. All right, let's continue our Thieves Guild adventures. Okay, Baron Dar, what do you have to say? Ah, Velsa tells me you were the one who freed Baron Dar from Kosh's leash. That's right. The cub is more seasoned than she admits, but Varendar's eyes are sharper than his claws. Tongue, too, where Velsa is concerned. I have missed her conversation. Both are the guilds to serve, and so now they serve you, too. Velsa said you could help me locate some big scores. Oops, let's use the right thing. Ah, a good tip is only one of the services I provide, boss. Think of Farendar as your observer, guide, and porter. You handle the theft, I will handle the rest. Alright, Let, uh, let's hear more about these tip-offs. Farendar's little birds post things of interest at the guild. If something catches your eye too, speak up and we plan the heist. Go through me or not at all. We don't want members stepping on each other's toes or skimping on their dues. All right. And what did you mean by guide? Wealth in Abba's landing comes and goes like it's tides. What washes in isn't here for long or left about like flotsam to be scooped up by any passerby. There are many hidden nooks where such things are tucked away. Farendar knows them all. Oh, you mentioned being my, my porter. You're starting to sound like a butler. Perhaps I am. A very sneaky butler who ensures that all things reach their proper destination. Loot from an industrious thief's sticky fingers into a wanting buyer's tender embrace and gold from a happy buyer's pocket to a deserving thief's palm. All right, I'm ready for my first heist. Then we should see what my magpies have brought back to the nest. I'll await you at the tip board in the guild hall. All right, all right, let's go talk to Velsa. In her garden. <laughs> Fancy, smancy. So, yeah, I'm kind of um, wary about this quest name, though. A faded flower? Uh, is this because she's old? Is this because she's old and retired? I don't know if I like that, you know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, trespass? But maybe I'm just reading too much. Yeah, what the heck? I didn't know I'm trespassing. Just to stumble upon this locale. Spiders, probably nothing. All right. Oh, spiders! And they're everywhere. Where do I go? This way. No, spiders, you, down. you can't see me. You can't see me. You can't see me. You can't see me. Got it. Do the spiders out There's more mountain? spiders downstairs. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Seriously, that was more dangerous than the first time we went to our house. <laughs> I know, what has changed? <laughs> My skill level's gone down, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Hmm. Yeah, I right. agree to that. What the heck? I'm sorry. No, your skill level was perfect. Thank I'm you. Amazing. <laughs> Appreciate right. it. There she is. Oh, uh, is she looking at a withered flower? A faded flower. Took your time, so didn't you? I did. But you're here. I got your note. You wanted to talk to me? I... 
I need your help. I was in the market when someone slipped me a letter. It might not mean anything, but on the other hand, it might be some sort of trap. Tell me more about this letter you received. A folded sheet of paper unsigned. It was only a few lines wishing me well. But when I unfolded the sheet, an old pressed stargazer peony fell out. That... that unsettled me. What's a stargazer peony? It's a flower. Others just like it blossomed all around my family home. But I left my family behind a long time ago. If this is their way of sending me a message, I need to know why now, after all these years. You want me to find out who sent the letter and why? You've consistently demonstrated a lack of incompetence. Find out if my family... Finally, a compliment. It. I didn't part on the best of terms, so it could be a trap. But they won't expect you, which means it shall be slow to spring. You must have some notion of what this is all about. Decades ago, I was Velsa Arundis of House Drez. Yes, the one built on the spoils of the slave trade. When I fled, I released dozens of slaves, gave them gold from the house treasury. I regret not seeing the look on Mother's face, but nothing else. You didn't see the person who slipped you the net letter? Yes, but I didn't realize it then. I was taking a merchant to task for her prices when a half-naked Nord bumped into me. That's when it happened. He fled before I could give him a piece of my mind toward the merchant camp outside the city gates. I'll ask around and see what I can find out. Alright. So, good news, it was just the flower. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, how do I get out? Oh, read the letter. Of you Look down. <laughs> it has taken a long time to find you. Know that someone thinks of you and hopes you are well. All right. Find the half naked Nord. All right. I gotta admit, though, like, I don't appreciate that I have to trespass to get to see her. Like, exactly. The <laughs> and then pass her a room full of spiders. Yeah. What's up with that? These are tight, but. Guess not. All right. Let's go through the secret passage. Pass by the spiders. And trespass. All right. Oh, I'm still trespassing. <laughs> Alright, no bounty. We did good. Yeah, those spiders saw you. Oh, I don't think okay. they saw me. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh, there's a half naked Nord. Go find him. Put our shirt on, sir. But he should be back shortly if you need something. I'm still learning the business, and I'm not allowed to do anything. My uncle says I don't have a head for numbers. I say as long as my head looks pretty, what else matters? Did you slip a letter into a Dark Elf's pack? What? No, that wasn't me. Did you see something? There are plenty of half-naked <laughs> There are on the bar's landing. Oh, stop interrogating me. I'll confess. It was me. <laughs> I asked you one question. Me. But that's all I can say. Client confidentiality, you know. Alright, it's important to someone. Just tell me. Not breaking my word is important too. But also <laughs> mead. Mead mm. is important. I wonder what your uncle would say about your little side business. He might want to cut. You tell my uncle? Yeah. That's not very friendly of you. Oh, very <laughs> well. I met a Kajit woman in Ralka when I was drinking at the inn. She paid me to deliver the letter to the Dark Elf lady here. Never got the Kajit's name, though. Sorry. All right. No problem. So... 
I don't have intimidation, so I had to pay him money. Oh. That's a dirt. That's like the first thing you need to get. <laughs> that the, is under the fighter skills, and the other one is the major skill. I don't have it yet. I, don't, I mean, I don't have the. Oh, uh, you don't, don't have the guilds yet. Oh, just travel to one of the cities, like uh, Somerset or something. You wouldn't catch me and talk to somebody. Yeah. Like do not do that. Like yourself. I did it and I survived. Oh, okay. I, I, I you, I died. <laughs> how, how did you do that? I was like, oh, you lived. <laughs> I, I, I was like, I saw that you lived. I was like, oh, I guess it's not as bad, but I died. <laughs> That's hilarious. I guess some people have it and some people already. don't. <laughs> 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 All right, let's go to um, Woodharth. <laughs> Reaper's March. Yeah, I oh, guess down. we're gonna go to Rawl. Rawl, whatever the heck it's Rawlka. I'm going the long way because I can just travel there. I have a house in Reaper's March, <laughs> but this is more fun. <laughs> we get to take boats and stuff. We can find room, depending on Yeah, let's take a month-long journey. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to travel within the Altmary Dominion, please. Tell me. Malibor tour, when you're ready. Okay, this is really gonna be the long way. <laughs> We're getting closer, though. We're getting closer. Okay. Hey! I'm gonna take your wagon, please. We depart within the hour. Where are you headed? I'd like to travel within the Altmary Dominion. Tell me. Reach it, a uh, Reaper's March, if you will. All right. Finally, I could have just fast traveled to my house. This was more fun. It was. I mean, two boat rides and, and a wagon. Ride later. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we're here. Now what? There, over here. Excuse me, please. I have a message for you. Oh, Faradan, huh? Don't recall seeing you before. You sound familiar. So many new people coming through. Makes my head spin. I'm looking for a Khajiit woman. Not at all the question I expected. You have piqued my curiosity. Why do you seek some random Khajiit? Is there some problem? She sent a letter to a friend. A friend wants to reconnect. Oh, well, in that case, an elderly Khajiit does work here. She's a cook, bakes the best pies in town. They really are quite tasty. But she's indisposed at present. I won't let you disturb her rest. How long has she been working here? That's something you'll have to ask her. Uh. It's not my place to talk about the hired help. Yeah. I do believe she travelled a fair bit in her youth, though. Mm -hmm. Can you at least tell me her name? I suppose that won't do any harm. Narani is a kind, gentle old woman, and a master baker of scrumptious pies. The people here are very fond of her, and very protective. Mm. Thanks for your help. Yes? Hi. Oh, dear. Your face. This one doesn't recognize it. Are you looking for a piece of pie? I am wearing a mask, so that might be why you won't recognize me. I came to talk to you. Did you send a letter to Velsa Arendis? Velsa? She didn't come with you? No. Oh, this one was foolish to even send the letter in the first place. Or the peony. I hope the years would have softened her memories. That she might have wanted to see her old friend one more time before the end. Why send a letter? You should have just gone to see her. This one is no longer the young and brave Khajiit that fell in love with Velsa, and it took a long time to even discover she might be in Abba's Landing. Now I am old and my mind isn't what it once was. Velsa would never even recognize me. I think you should go and talk to her. Do you really think so? Mm -hmm. Perhaps that would be best. Enough time has gone by without this one seeing Velsa's sweet face. Even if she's still angry, at least I can tell her that I never betrayed her. Since she didn't come here, I'll have to go to her. 
She didn't come here because she was afraid the letter was a trap. Oh, stupid Narani. This one should have thought of that. Yeah. She feared her terrible family was trying to lure her out of hiding. I should have signed the letter. Mm -hmm. But you must understand, when we parted, Velsa was hurt very much. Tell me what happened, like it's my business. Velsa loathed her family's business. <laughs> this one was a slave then, working in the family's kitchens. We fell in love. We made a plan to free all the slaves, but she thought I betrayed her. She disappeared before I had a chance to explain. Then you need to go to Abba's Landing. Narani, are you all right? I specifically stated that you were not to be disturbed. Easy, my friend. This one has decided that the time has come to travel and mend old wounds. The letter bore fruit. I wish you well, but we're going to miss your pies around here. Could you open a portal to a buzz landing, my friend? Oh, can I go in that way? You remember those bandits? Can I use the portal? Gladly, I can't keep it open for long. The innkeeper doesn't like me using magicka in here. This one will write to me, and I'll even sign the letter this time. Of course. Now, give me a moment to concentrate. Impressive, I guess. I think I could have done it if I wasn't so busy. Yay! Take this portal to a buzz landing. If you dislike portal travel. I, I, I went in before she even started talking. <laughs> so <laughs> like, you're not closing this on me. Sometimes portals Bye. can be tricky. All right. Did he port us into our trespassing? This isn't my fault. I didn't choose to trespass. I swear. <laughs> I know. Time flows so differently for a Khajiit and a dark elf. I am old now, but Velsa... No matter. This one will be glad to see her friend again. Velsa lives in a secluded place. Let me know when you're ready to see her. Ready? Mm -hmm. oh, this one is nervous, but I am also ready. Lead on and I will follow. All right, I'll lead you through a secret passage a secret with spiders. Passage? I hope you don't mind. Velsa always loves secret passages. <laughs> right. Let's go. All right, all right, let's go. Make sure you're squatting, right, lady. Yeah. Oh, this person scared me. I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Another player. <laughs> We're set to proceed. Ah, dark and dusty. Just like the secret passages from my... I'm sorry, I cut you off. <laughs> we don't have time for your <laughs> rambling <laughs> old woman. <laughs> Not that oh. overly concerned. Is she coming? Someone who lacked the courage to sign their name, but now oh. wants to make amends. Narani, is it really you? Just the sight of you opens all wounds. Oh, Velsa, I know what you saw. Resting what you up must before have thought. I'm ready to this fall over. This one never meant to hurt That's you. you. I saw you in my brother's arms. He was the worst of my family. How could you? He arrived at exactly the wrong moment. I had to do something, or our entire plan would have failed. You... you didn't betray us? You did that for me? It was the only way to guarantee your escape. There's too many people in here, I can't see them. I let the years flow by without giving you a chance to explain. Oh, what a waste. But I'll make it up to you. I'll keep you safe. <laughs> Your dragon is being very rude. Uh, what are you talking about? <laughs> what happiness feels like. He's house trained. Yes. Kind of. <laughs> I suppose it is. You seem glad to see uh, Narani again. <laughs> I had no idea this would be the result of sending you to find a half-naked Nord. Last time I saw Narani, it was quite unpleasant. There was poison in that wound. I don't think it ever truly healed. You weren't—you weren't an easy person to get along with, that's for sure. 
You reunited me with my one true love, so I choose to ignore that. <laughs> I hope there's time to share a few lasting moments before all is said and done. You both have a lot of catching up to do. All these wasted years, we've missed out on so much. Narani wears them like a cloak, though with grace and style. I am grateful you convinced her to come here. All right. Yeah. Cool. Drag. Silverclaw has information you'll want to hear. Right. Okay, so Silverclaw. So library. Silverclaw has information. So what does uh, Silverclaw know? The Iron Wheel is about to put Zira on a prison ship to Tanith. Zira. Silverclaw found out when it's going to happen. This is the only chance we'll have to recover our guildmaster before All she's right. locked away in a Tanith dungeon. All right, I'll talk to Silverclaw. Tell Quinn, walk softly, and Velsa to meet us. All right, so we have that one. Mm -hmm. And I'll pick up the other one that you were talking about, if I can find my way. It's the same one. Is it um, Prison Break? Is that the one you just bought? Yeah, Prison Break. Yeah, me too. So I think it was... um. The same a person? Yeah, I, I think the same quest, different people for different entrances, All right. maybe. Cool. Okay, Silverclaw. Now, where is the guildmaster? Or actually, I'm right. guildmaster? I'm, I'm right gonna here. break one person out of prison. Look who's here. I'm right here. Your long wait is I over. have good news, my friend. Chief Inspector Ranbeek and the Iron Wheel will soon depart Hughesbane. And the bad news? Zira will be sent to Tanith, where she will stand trial for raiding Aldenobia tomb. Where is the Iron Wheel holding Zira? Somewhere in Noshira Citadel. The Iron Wheel's preparations to depart causes much distraction. There is no better time to slip among their ranks. But I am not a part of your guild. You would know best what to do, of course. I'll put this information to good use. All right. We know where Zira is. Are we going to rescue her? What do you mean, we? I'm retired. Zira would do the same for any of us, even you, Velsa. The least we can do is hear out our acting guildmaster. So, what is the plan? Um, we gotta tell people where they need to be. If we're going to know Shira Citadel, I can help. The Iron Wheel can always spot imposters. It's not the uniform, it's the mannerisms and protocol they follow. It's all part of their training. What do you mean? They cycle their soldiers between locations every few months. Keeps them from forming attachments with the locals. They see new faces all the time, so they're trained to spot certain mannerisms. Ones I've learned to spot as well. And impersonate. You can impersonate an Iron Wheel soldier? I just need a uniform. They change those too. Small details here and there. We need one that can accommodate my tail. Oh, and bring the journal we used in Aldenobia tomb. I have an idea, but until we know our entry point, I don't want to share. I'll bring the journal. We'll find you an Iron Wheel uniform when we get there. I love that plan, because it's all about, like, chance that a uniform will be there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll just all pick right. one up, don't worry. <laughs> Quinn. I know it won't be easy to recover Zira, but I'm ready for this. Just say the word. What do you know about Noshira as a citadel? Lots of crumbling walls. I can scout the best approach, see if the Iron Wheel leaves anything less defended. They won't notice me. No one ever looks up. Then scout Noshira Citadel, look for the best way in. Let me see your map. This place, just outside Noshira Citadel? I'll meet you there when I've found a way inside. See you there, partner? See you there. I know that look. <laughs> That's your tell Velsa to do something look. Why do none of you believe I'm retired? I could say it slowly. Retired. Because you're standing here. Time? We need to recover Zira from Noshira Citadel. Come on. I now. only traveled to Aldenobia tomb because I had history with the people who died there. But poking around the Iron Wheel's headquarters? Lunacy. I need a phenomenal reason to risk my life for Zira's. I helped you bring Nahari home. Help me do the same for Zira. You did, and I am grateful. But rescuing Zira is a tall order. I'll do so on one condition. Promise to help Narani should she ever need it. 
I want her final years to be without the pain she suffered in the time that came before. I promise. Now about Noshira Citadel. I'm going to smash some stink apples at the front gate to draw the iron wheel there. The distraction will make it easier for you to get in elsewhere. What? Your temporary Zira. You think I ever let her tell me what to do? That's good to know. All right. Who's next? Evidence of Nicholas's treachery. All right. Let's go. I torture myself walking this is through this very, city. Very bad. Shit has gone through the sewers to the outside. These are troubling times. When we forget the past, it has a disturbing tendency to rear up behind us and bite us in the arse. That's a grim prognosis. Perhaps, but that doesn't make it less true. Did you know that Prince Hugh buried his family's secret shame in his own ancestral tomb? It involved his mad uncle Magnifico Baraha who tried to form a necromantic cult under the prince's very nose. And that would have been bad? Oh, most definitely. Luckily, the prince discovered his uncle's treachery and trapped the necromancers inside the tomb. Priests were gathered to create a great seal to make sure they couldn't escape. Unfortunately, pirates decided to loot the tomb. I'll help if I can. What do you need me to do? You must recharge the great seal. The necromancers are using the pirates' life energy to weaken it. Take my amulet, Spirit Catcher, and use it to capture the unleashed spirits. Then you can use that same energy to repair the seal. How many spirits do I need to catch? Not many. Once the amulet has absorbed enough spirits, you can use it to repair the great seal at the tomb's far end. Ironic that the same energy the necromancers use to weaken the seal can also be used to repair it. It's your amulet. Why do you need my help? I am the last of my order. And I walk a different path from you. If I die, the Great Seal will eventually fail and the Necromancers will escape the tomb. I'd like to postpone that occurrence for as long as possible. I'm sure you understand. Aren't the Necromancers long dead? Ah, I see you aren't familiar with the term Necromancer. Trapped in kind of am, but... They embraced undeath before they could expire from lack of food and water. I don't like to consider how they went about accomplishing that feat. All right. Alright, are we doing prison break or are we Yeah, doing... I'm gonna so die. Holy I didn't die. Are you jumping from great heights again? <laughs> I always jump from great heights. That's my favorite. <laughs> it's funny though, because like cats are supposed to land on their feet. <laughs> I did land on my feet. It just hurt really bad. <laughs> <laughs> Earlier, I landed on my face, I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Where did you go? Did you go to Spirit Catcher? Shoot. I'm glad you said something. <laughs> I'm glad you said something. Because oh, I was- There's no way she's that far behind me. <laughs> alright, alright. Alright, alright. I'll, I'll catch up quicker than you think. Yeah, I know. You're so fast. Oh, there's a sky shard over here. I'm gonna go get this by the way. That's a world boss, I guess.
Alright. <laughs> Come in! Alright, Quinn. What do you, what'd you, what'd, what'd you know? Scouting successful. The Iron Wheel doesn't send patrols beyond the walls anymore. They're too busy preparing to leave. And there's some sort of commotion at the main gate. Seems they've pulled a few soldiers there to deal with it. That must be Valsa's distraction. Did you find a way in? A gap in the wall not far from here. There's a lone sentry. I already told Walk Softly. He's waiting for you near the gap. I'll find walk softly. I'll head back to the walls. Keep scouting the citadel exterior. Good luck. Alright. Oh yeah, I gotta find this random guard uniform for him. Jeez. Seriously. <laughs> Better overstock than under. Um, jump? <laughs> I probably should have took the bridge. That might might have been a little bit better. Yeah, it's too late. <laughs> You're pretty mighty, that didn't take you very long. Oh, I thought you helped me. <laughs> no, I was getting ready to. You killed it before I could even shoot my arrow. Nice. It does some work. I guess. I got a little distracted, but I'm on my way. I can't seem to get this note. There we go. Up, oh, up! Oh, something's attacking me. Or you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you brought this big thing in with you. I didn't bring it in there. Ran there on its own. <laughs> All right. <laughs> hey, walk softly. Do you see the sentry? He keeps looking through the gate. Yeah. his lips. Waiting for one of his mates to come by with a drink. Let's relieve him of his thirst. Then his uniform. What's your plan? We walk up. I present myself as a drunk, dapper Argonian. He challenges us, tells us to move along, then sees the bottle in my hand. I offer him a taste. He takes a long pull from one of Velsa's sleeping potions. We take his uniform. All right, let's go. I like it. Non-threatening, if... At all possible. I don't know if that's possible. I'm pretty, pretty, uh... Pretty I'm mighty. Okay, I'm pretty, I walked off away, so... I'm pretty, I'm pretty scary, My yeah. Man. If you have this instincts, you know to be Land. afraid of me. Halt! <laughs> the Citadel is under jurisdiction of the Iron Wheel. Huh. Never heard of that tavern. What do they sell? You should move along. What, um... That bottle you have. What is that? Delicious! Some wine from... Ah, uh, Burga, Burga, Burga Mats, Bergama. Why, you want some? If you're offering, just a nip to get my blood pumping. <laughs> nice gulping. Tava's tail feathers, it's awful. Ugh. What, uh, what is that, that taste? Maybe you should lie down. Something to which I'm immune. But he's right. It does taste awful. <laughs> All right, let's go. You can take his, his uniform. You take his uniform. All right. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, maybe it's magic. My distraction. I won't question. As expected. <laughs> I'll stick to the shadows for now. Here we part ways. Once I'm in uniform, I'll see how well I blend in. If I may suggest a course of action, the journal you brought contains the entire dowry heist as planned by Nicholas. I think we can use it to our advantage. How do we do that? Chief Inspector Ron Beek has an office in the ruins where he entertains guests. If you were to leave the journal for him to find, 
there is little chance Nicholas could weasel out of the trial he faces in Tanith. Oh, and you could find out where they're holding Zira. Locate Zira and make life harder for Nicholas. I'll do it. Good luck. Don't get caught. <laughs> I'm not if trying to. We'll have to spring two guildmasters. Shameful times for the thieves' guild. I. Uh, you go ahead. I'll abscond with our sentry yeah, friends. Yeah, the thing about that walk softly is. I will probably have to kill some people not to be seen. I don't think I'm gonna get by this guy. I guess we could go around. Am I going the wrong way? I'm just sitting here killing beetles. Oh my god, there's some dead person here. Alright. So go the right way now. <laughs> oh. You distract them and then I'll go. Wait, uh, the right way. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Yeah, I think so. Keep I can use the blade of well on him. Should I? Kill this fool? Are we supposed to go this way? I can't tell. I think so. There's a wow. bridge over there. Maybe we should go that way? Alright. I don't think th that's doable without killing him, because he's not moving. Um, uh, I just went by him. It you did? I just walked right by him. Are you I'd serious? And I'd, I'm serious. I'm, I'm over here. Oh no! I was caught! Well, you're gonna have to kill him. <laughs> nah, I hid, and he's fine. He doesn't see me anymore. Uh, they're poor out of sight. See another way. I walked by him too. He didn't see me, weirdo. Break. I have uh, invisibility still. Um, many of them, but I guess I do have six seconds of invisibility. You can run really, really fast. Wait, where is my six seconds? There's a basket up here, too, to hide in. No invisibility. Where'd they go? <laughs> they <laughs> totally saw you. I know. See that? Probably something. <laughs> I said detected, there. but I just kept running, and I guess it's detected like a blur, and then ignored me. I guess it's not worth it. I'm not getting the heavy sack. I'm sorry. <gasps> All right, I made it somehow. I have no quarrel with you. My dowry is safely returned to Aldenobia tomb, as are the remains of my ancestor. Those responsible are in custody. Yet I am not entirely satisfied with the outcome. Nor am I. My former fiancé Kosh, that is Nikolaus, has been very cooperative with the Iron. He claims he was duped, that stealing my dowry was Zira's plan all along. Zira has said nothing. What do you think? Zira's price to surrender was the safety of those she brought along to the wedding. You and your strange little friend. Almost honorable in her own way. Nicholas lies. I know that now. But Chief Inspector Ron Beek has no evidence to the contrary. I have evidence. I'll trade it for Zira's freedom. The town criers in Teneth already proclaim her trial. Politics as they are, 
I cannot simply release her. But I can tell you where she is. And I can offer a lucrative proposal to your entire organization. To her directly, once you free her. Deal. Here, read this journal. It will prove Nicholas's guilt. Good. Zira is held in the prisons beneath us, but you must hurry. Chief Inspector Ron Beek plans to move her to where I do not know. I'll escort you to the prison door. If you stay by my side, the iron wheel shall cause you no harm. Are you ready? I'm ready. Hey, I follow this fool. Yeah, she's walking so slow. Remember. Don't leave my side, or the Iron Wheel will think you're an intruder. All right. Which, by all accounts, you are. I... Okay, yeah, I was about to say I am an intruder, so... You got me. I'm not... But, like, how close do I need to be you? I'm, like, walking right next to her. <laughs> yeah, you look natural, though. I'm, like... <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I saw something. <laughs> Oh, Once you're inside the prison, you're on your own. <laughs> oh crap! I'm okay. Okay. Act natural. There needs to be like a circle or something. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> just don't mind us, we're just walking you here. There. Unlock the door and allow my companion entry to the prison. Do not record this in the log. As you command. You there, follow me. I will. Not suspicious at all. Thankfully, I recognize that voice. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Iron wheel uniforms aren't made for Argonian heads. Ugh. I'd be sweating if. Well, if I could sweat. It's not bad looking armor, though. I'll wait for the others and escort them through. Mm hmm. All right. Yes, you wait for the others. Freaking wish I had that job, right? Jeez. Suspicious relief. I'm gonna open you. Yeah. I'm gonna go in this basket. I have to see where those guys are going. Ouch! I jumped but didn't make it. <laughs> You're gonna stand right there. Perfect. All right, where does she go? Yellow. <laughs> All right, that was fun. <laughs> oh my god, are we becoming good thieves? <laughs> yeah, we might be. <laughs> Actually learning something. Unreal. And who might uh, you be? Uh... Who are you? Oh. What's up? You certainly don't belong. Who are you and why are you here? Tell me where I can find Zira. Straight to the point. Yep. Very good. I know where Chief Inspector Ron Beek took Zira. I'm willing to tell you. My only price is a single lockpick. Oh, uh, why would I free you? I didn't ask you to free me. A single lockpick from one thief to another. A tradition Zira began, which means bad luck for her should you break it. Ah, but we have company. And they seem ambivalent to the idea. Oh, that thought. 
Ah, walk softly. Mm -hmm. So good to see you again. How have you been? Hunted. Missing too many dead friends. And Velsa as well. I thought you'd retired. And I thought you were dead. Seems we were both disappointed. And who are you? I don't believe we've met. I'm someone who knows better than to listen to your lies. Well, is there honor among thieves, or will you prove Zira wrong? I've made my decision. Good, good. Always commit fully, even when your heart brims with doubt. Now, the lockpick? What do you, what do you think? Hard choice. Yeah, because I don't want to free him, but then know. he's going to tell us where Zira is. Maybe? Hmm. Well, do we want to do it the hard way, you know? Let's not give it to him, right? Yeah, I agree. I agree. I'm leaning toward that cheat. No lockpick. Nothing. I'm not a thief. I don't know why I'm here. <laughs> you don't get a lockpick. You don't get anything. Misguided, but I understand. Zira always treasured loyalty over, well, treasure. To show there's no hard feelings between us, you could try the warden's office for her transfer papers. It's under guard, but you look like you can manage. All right, we're done here. Search the warden's office. Look for any clue that leads us to Zira. Do what you think is right, partner. Ouch. That, I did, I did hit my face. My oh my face, gosh. my face went right into the floor. And I bounced off the wall and went into that trap. <laughs> yeah, I started crouching so I could see them. I guess I should have called it out. I thought... No, I saw it. I, I jumped over it, but I hit the wall and bounced and hit the trap. <laughs> it, it was pretty talented. It was pretty amazing. Crazy. I did take those coins. Because I'm a thief. Wait, I said I wasn't. Alright. Yes, you did. Iron Will uh, Prisoner Transfer Zira. Prisoner to be transferred Zira of a Boz Landing, aka a Dan Danazira, aka Guildmaster of the Thieves Guild. Vessel of transfer, the ship Enamane, to depart directly from Noshira Citadel to Teneth. There to be held until trial. Custodial duty, prisoner to be released into custody of Teneth Guard. Captain or Iron Wheel, a bailiff at Teneth Harbor. Uh, crime summarized as larceny, grand larceny, trespassing, conspiracy, and evading justice. Additional notes. Most recently imprisoned a guest at the wedding of Magnifica Flora. Um, specific details to be delivered upon my return to Tana. All right. Oh! <laughs> How did he not see me? Like, I literally kissed his back. Ooh, shoot, guard down by ah! <laughs> Um, ma'am? Ma'am. Nothing to see here. Just turn yourself around. Keep walking. You don't see us. We're crouching at the top of the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Move on now. Move on. Move on. Is she just gonna stand there the whole time? I'm not sure we move. I don't know. Okay, to the basket. I took some invisibility potion. That works too. I didn't, I didn't know why I didn't think of that. <laughs> I'm using. I don't know if you're supposed to use the basket that way. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Made it. All right, let's go rescue. Who are we rescuing again? <laughs> All right, when is my potion ready? Oh crap, he's going. Nope. It's okay. Nobody's here. There ain't nobody here. 
I got the key. I'm unstoppable. Oh shoot. I got something. I think we have to go up the plank. You are consistently a problem for me. Guard. <laughs> go ahead and go on board. Nobody's here. The security is appalling. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Are we supposed to be down here? Yeah, I think so. I'm oh, just right there. Just looking at what they're having for dinner, you know. The I guess we from talked to him. Fulstrom Homestead, wasn't it? Hey, what's up, Chief Inspector? Are you here? I'm like, she's already here. I mean, they're already. You're surrounded. Zira isn't going to tennis. So you say to an unarmed man, you seem to have the upper hand for the moment. This won't stop. The iron wheel shall not stop until there is a trial. Desecrating a family tomb, every noble in Tanith wants to see justice served. Tanith can have Nicholas. You mean Kosh? He insists he Nicholas. is duped by the Thieves' Guild. His story doesn't completely add up, but Zira has not spoken since her arrival. Without proof, his story is the most convincing. Magnifica Flora has proof. The journal Nicholas used to plan the dowry heist. Dowry heist? You name your crimes? Yeah, of course. I cool. once gave you a chance to surrender. Instead, you attacked my men and fled with a valuable relic. Of course. I'm not inclined to take you at your word. He did seem like the type. Please, take a moment. Let's be reasonable. Discuss this like adults. Right. The other thief? Surrender all of you. The Iron Wheel is relentless. We serve a higher calling than gold or riches. What? You seem the type to talk all day. <laughs> Zira, that was funny. you aren't the only prisoner we freed. They're on shore and itching to come back to the Thieves' Guild. It did yes, seem like yes, the type a charming talk. reunion. Very high You're welcome. <laughs> I almost said something pithy, like you're late or about time. But really, I'm glad to see every one of you, even Velsa. Welcome back. Are you all right? Better now that I'm out of that cell. I can't wait to return to the den after we've taken care of some business. What sort of business? Let's find a rowboat. How do I get in there? Okay. Or out. Might I say you are the most magnificent Magnifica I've ever met. <laughs> you elevate the cesspit of Abba's landing with your very Who presence. Who are you again? <laughs> Apologies, Magnifica. We have much to discuss when timing is more convenient for us both. That jingle of coins, always a comfort. Nobody here wants to kill us, that's good. Robo! All right, we did it. Another beautiful chapter ending on Abba's Landing. Abba? Yep. Abba. 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 Abba's Landing. And I gotta say, I mean, I think we're getting good. I think so. We did really good. Like, I don't think so, but... <laughs> no we bounty? Done... That's impressive. We done good. 
Until I spent time in a cell, I didn't realize how much this place had grown on me. It's good to be back. But it's better to have robbed the Iron Will of their dignity, our guildmates, and a dockload of ill-gotten goods. Do you think they'll come after us? With what? They can't look to Magnifica Flora for help. She hired the Iron Wheel to recover her dowry. When they did, she stopped funding them. After what we took from the Iron Wheel... They'll barely have enough to ship Nicholas to Tanith. What will happen to Nicholas? What they'd plan to do with me. They'll put him on trial. A show trial because the people want revenge. When he's convicted, well, I hear the guillotine is popular in Tanith. But Nicholas is the past. I'm interested in the future. Magnifica Flora had an offer for the Thieves Guild. Never waste an opportunity. Huh. Nicholas used to say that. Well then, let's see what Tanith nobles think lucrative means. All right. As for the rest of you, I'm naming you as part of my thieves' council. I'll need those I can trust in the coming months. Yes, even Velsa. Counselor Emeritus, if it suits you. This calls for a drink. Or five. Where's Undai? Huzzah! Meaningless title. <laughs> Huzzah! Don't be so, well, you. All right, so I think that's it, right? Your apologies for interrupting. Your Lord Thrag escorted me here. Magnifica Falora requests Zira call upon her at the earliest convenience. I'll have to celebrate later. Opportunity waits for none of us, whatever title we have. What would you have us do? Stare at one another until your return? What does it matter to you? Aren't you retired? Semi-retired. And what would you suggest? Old hands and sing songs? Hardly. The only tune you know is grating. Mm. <laughs> I think I'm starting to like you. That's it for today. Thank you everybody for watching.